Hey gang, so welcome to another show home tour. Today I am at Red Row and this is the Blenheim show home. I believe that's how you pronounce it. And it's a five bedroom home. The exterior already looks absolutely amazing. I love how they've set it out. So let's go in. it is gorgeous <laughs> look at that staircase i am just that oh my god sorry i'm just amazed by this whole home already so obviously i'll just step back here but as you can see the whole space is ridiculous like there's so so much space on your entranceway and that unreal stair carpet runner is absolutely gorgeous of that mirror as well so as you come in on the right they got these gorgeous absolutely gorgeous oak doors they are beautiful and this living space is ridiculous it's absolutely gorgeous them bay windows are just next level look at those curtains the quality just can't be matched i know the girl who's actually the interior designer for red row and she's absolutely smashed it i just can't believe it the couches are gorgeous the cushions are just beautiful lovely spring colors that mirror <gasps> i really want that mirror um i love all the styling that they've done as well the wallpaper is absolutely gorgeous i'm aware by the way that sometimes in these show home tours i do get a bit excited so i do sometimes spin it around quite fast i'm gonna try and do my best this time not to do so um gorgeous accessories the fabulous donut vases from h&m but honestly i am just obsessed that canvas is beautiful there's an unreal fireplace, which I don't think comes as standard. I think that might be an add-on for you as well. Um, and then here is a gorgeous Andrew Martin book. A double coffee table and stool. There's just so, so much space in here, as you can see. You can get two couches in here. I'm not sure whether this might be the main living space. I'm not too sure. But I suppose you can have it as ever, whichever way you want. But no, honestly... The floor space is amazing. Um, so these show homes are actually in the Allerton Walton area, I believe. Um, oh, wow. So this is the dining space. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just think it's beautiful. I could cry how gorgeous it is. They've styled it stunning. So obviously you can fit an eight person dining table in here you've got the go the bay windows make the difference and in red row homes as well you get the ceiling height you don't get that in another um, new build so it feels like a really stunning room them lights <laughs> i'm sorry i'm not over it and i love this cracked um speckled mirror as well um it's absolutely gorgeous sorry i'm not over this face as you can tell when you're an interior designer and you come to an unreal show home like this i'm like obsessed so i love the wall coverings i love just the style and pieces as well yeah so to the left of the dining room as you come out we have a cubby i don't know whether this might just be oh it's kind of an under the stairs situ thought it might have been um another little room um and then through here is this downstairs toilet <gasps> it is <gasps> gorgeous what a th oh my god how massive is that that's like bigger than my actual toilet and this is just downstairs low absolutely love it oh my god i jumped out my skin then i thought what's that noise it's these <laughs> flipping blue shoes things i keep thinking someone's gonna walk in and i'm just like hi just filming um but honestly this is gorgeous so a lovely sink with actual storage space as well which is always a plus um white company noir um, and then a toilet and a plant as well and this little situation styling a few pictures honestly love that wall color and by the way love it but honestly how big is that like my feet are size seven so like that is quite a few feet do you know what i mean i don't know the measurements exactly but i will leave all the details for the actual home the measurements and everything else um below for you but honestly look look how big that is that is ridiculous i love the tiles they've used as well as i say a lot of it doesn't come as standard it just comes with the home and then you've obviously got to decorate it yourself but it's great inspiration to take out for you we come through here <gasps> oh my god use <laughs> what 
<laughs> I'm sorry. Like the other Red Room homes I've showed, like I've done show home tours before, but oh my god. I actually cannot cope, you know? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> this is mad. I'm sorry. This is unreal. The space you get is crazy. I love this styling as well. Styling ideas from this because... Oh, I love that book as well. If I find that book, I'll link it for you. Perfect and perfect. Stunning. Um, Yeah, it's absolutely gorgeous. Look at the space. Sorry, I'm just going to go slowly because I know I get a bit excited. Look at the space. You've got another dining table. So you could actually use that front room as... Oh, oh my God. Girl. I need to speak to the interior designer because not over this styling. I'm really not. I'm going to have to take a picture of this for me flipping Instagram because unreal. Look at that styling. Sorry, and now, like, I'm an interior designer. I'm obviously going to talk about the styling. But look at that kitchen. You deserve a min. You deserve a min. I cannot go. What the hell? It's insane. The sage green is absolutely gorgeous. There's about 45 ovens. There's a wine cabinet. I just love the sage green. It's absolutely gorgeous. Red Row Homes actually get their kitchens to be made specifically for them by a company, which I can't um, remember the name of. Um, the marble worktops are gorgeous. The styling's beautiful. I'm sorry. I know we keep talking about it. I mean, I know we're not here for interior design, but I'm here for it. But honestly, just look at how much storage. And they've got an induction hob as well. I think you can pick induction or gas, but I prefer induction personally. <gasps> look at that. Oh, my God. Stop it. <gasps> oh. Sorry, use, but incredible. So as you come round here, there's, I'm presuming this might be a pantry. Oh, is that fake? Oh, no. Oh, no, it's a fridge. Oh, my God. I don't know, I'm scared, but oh, my God, I think it's a fridge freezer situ. Look how big this house is. I'm sorry, use, this is ridiculous. This is massive. This is next level, like Red Row. Oh, my God. Oh, my God, there's a pure G. Changing room. What the hell? Amazing. Amazing. So obviously you've got like a changing area, you know, if you're a horse rider because you know you might have horses in the garden and want to get changed, but oh, I can't cope. How unreal. So obviously they've kept the consistency with the sage green cabinet. You can get a washer dryer, anything here. This is a bit like a laundry space, storage, coat, shoes, you name it. Obviously, got the gorgeous oak doors. Can we just take him in for this house? Oh my god. I'm actually not over it. It's actually beautiful. <laughs> I feel like crying. Do you ever get that? So on the back, obviously, you've got your bifold doors. Um, and then and not a lot of space for a garden, especially with a house this size. But it's fairly big. I don't know whether that's like a shed. Or whether that's oh no, I think that's where oh no, that's where I've just been to come into the show room. But honestly, it's absolutely gorgeous by the way. The weather today, stunning, look at that. But honestly, let me just do a little pano because look at that. I just I can't. Right, so we're gonna go up these unreal stairs. I'm not over these stair rods, they're absolutely gorgeous. And then as we come up the stairs, <gasps> what? No use, look at that landing. What? Sorry. Oh my God, sorry, I want this house. <laughs> I would have a Christmas tree at a Christmas. No doubt about that. That chair is absolutely unreal. I don't know what that chair is, I need to find out, but trap. Oh my God, and the view as well from this window will be gorgeous. Like, look at that. <gasps> oh my God. So this is actually an upgrade for the carpet and landing situ. But, wow. <laughs> right, so as we come up the stairs, I'm presuming, I don't think this is the master bedroom, but it's a good size bedroom, whatever it is. I absolutely love it. I love the styling, I think it's gorgeous. I love the bed, the bay window. The little wardrobe space. I don't think it's the master. Love the ottoman at the end of the bed. Again, it's a very big size space. Um, and it's also got an ensuite. Can't go wrong, girls. Lovely shower space. That shower's beautiful. Again, we've got 
our white company favies and then i love all this like illustrative work as well gorgeous tile the space in here i can't even i cannot even like honestly gorgeous i love the tiles they are beautiful it's such a big space as i say i'll leave all the details to this home below and then that's good i'd have put a mirror there maybe but you know wow <laughs> what a bathroom sorry i can't i need to take a picture of this i'm obsessed so gorgeous styling little radiator hidden behind the door which we love what do you think about the silver hardware? I think gold would have looked much nicer. The marble tiles are gorgy. You can get a sink, bath and toilet and shower in here, which is amazing. I think this is the only red row, actually, that you can actually get a tub and a shower, which I've looked in so far, um, which this option is available. If you look at my previous house tours, um, I don't think you get that much, as much in even as that. And there's a the little ones. Honestly, these rooms are massive. Especially if you have like your youngest or you want to turn this into an office space. This is so, such a huge space. And space, I need to weigh out the square foot. But honestly, gorgeous, the feather light. Wow. It's such a pretty room. They style them amazingly. It's like a bit of an L shape, you know, as you come in. Um, but honestly, the styling is absolutely stunning. You can fit a wardrobe in here and also a chest of drawers. Or you could even, you could even maybe do like a fitted wardrobe over there and put the bed here. You know, as they get older or anything like that. It's just good to think ahead, especially with these red rows because they are an investment home. <laughs> I think this is the master bedroom and oh my god. <laughs> Can I take you home with me, please? Absolutely gorgeous. No, what's around here? <gasps> no. <laughs> this is actually a hotel. Sorry, these are the ward the wardrobe situ. Absolutely stunning. I can't cope. This house is absolutely gorgeous. Then here's like the ensuite. I've got obviously the double sink, which is gorgeous. And then I think these are the touch mirrors. Yeah, they are. Oh my god, I look a show. But anyway, <laughs> they're the touch mirrors. Um, they've obviously got more white company. The marble tiles are gorgeous. <gasps> I'm just obsessed with this space. <gasps> Them tiles are so, so fab. And this is a smart shower as well. I've never seen one of them before, but they are stunning. I can't cope with how spacious this is, obviously, with the walk-in wardrobe. And just how unreal this bedroom is. Here as well, you've got space for like a bit of a vanity to do your makey. You've got a gorgeous, massive mirror. I mean, you could put a telly on there if you wanted to, but I don't really like a TV in a room, <laughs> especially as a designer. It's just a no go. Love these marble lights. This bed is just stunning. How beautiful is this? I actually can't get over it, you know? That headboard. I need that in my life. If I can recreate that, I actually will. This just screams luxury though, doesn't it? Like, it's absolutely beautiful. That chandelier light is just next level. And obviously, if you pick a good spot as well with the view, you've got it here as well. And it is absolutely gorgeous. I'm just... I'm just not over these homes, basically. I think they're beautiful. They really do. Now, this room is just another room. It's absolutely beautiful. I love the design. The bed looks a lot smaller. I think this might be just a double. But to be fair, they've utilised the space really well. They're absolutely gorgeous. I love them lights as well. And there's actually an um, built-in wardrobe space, which is really good. But I think for the space that you'll have in here, it's utilised really well. Um, you've got still a lot of space to walk in between the bed and the wall. Yeah, it's just a really nice size. Obviously, a chest of drawers. You could put a desk in here. You could put something in the corner, maybe a little chair. There's honestly so many different variations you could do. And again, the tall ceilings are absolutely stunning. They really are. And here is the final bedroom. Again, very spacious. It's very much a lad's den at the back here, but it's absolutely gorgeous. Styled beautifully again. Gorgeous view out the window to the garden. I love them Pac-Man lights. They were in our work <laughs> in Home Zans even. I don't work there anymore, I still call it that. Um, and then, as I say, you could actually do fitted wardrobes across there, which would have been really good. Um, you know, just utilise the space a bit more. And also, if you're someone who needs the extra storage, I feel like you could have just, you could even add that there. Do you know what I mean? Um, but now it's a really good size space. 
obviously a double bed again so honestly there's just so these rooms are probably the most spacious i've ever seen a red row um home ever so as i say it's five beds you've got one two three four five. Oh my god i genuinely think this is the most beautiful red row home i have ever ever seen i am so impressed like this is the nicest one i've done a few show home tours and this is honestly the most unreal of them all i can't even go every time i've gone into a room i've been so shocked it's been absolutely gorgeous so yeah that is the end of this show home tour i do hope you've enjoyed it i'll leave all the details for the site and the home down below and i've also got a lot of other red row homes as well previously to this which i'll link below i'm also going to be filming the next show home on this site so do make sure you are subscribed so you don't miss it but i do hope you've enjoyed it let me know what you think of both the home and the obviously the interior as well and i will catch you on my next video